Popcorn Peeps. We are back and today, drum roll please, we're doing the reading series. The reading series. And today, we're reading Mogs and Mumps um, by Helen Nicole and Jan Pierre Nahowski. Sorry if I didn't pronounce the names right. Um, but let's read the blurb to find a bit. Oh. But look, as you can see, that's an X-ray. Morgs Mumps. So we're going to get on with the story now, okay? Oh, that's the back. Morgs Mumps by Helen Nicole and Jan Piankowski in London. Right. Mog was not ra well. Come for a ride. I've got a pain. Sorry. He looks puffy. Meg and Al carried him upstairs. Maybe it's mumps and put him into bed. They gave him a hot water bottle, a thermometer and a cat mint tea. But they forgot the spoon. Stir. Gully, am I dead? I will brew a potion. Meg got a crab apple and a dragonfly. Mumbo Jumbo, she boiled them in her cauldron and gave the potion to Mog. The medicine worked like magic. Gulp, ugh, yuck. Hmm? Meg looked at Mog's tongue. Oh dear, oh dear. I'll listen to his tummy. Hubble bubble. Baked, boiled, grilled or flied or fried. Show us what's in Mog's inside. Meg made an x-ray spell to see what was in Mog's tummy. Are those all bones? Those look like fish bones. He's eaten too much again. Little by little, Mog got better. Now you are well, you, you can have a treat. Meg let him have a ride on her broomstick. Whoosh. Look, no hands. Catastrophe. So Mog had to stay in bed until Christmas. The end. There we go. The end of the story. <coughs> we read this story today and it was great. So join us again for the reading series. Smash! Smash! Oh, gee. Don't do too much of a hard smash, but smash that um, subscribe button, the like button, the notification bell, the notification bell, mm -hmm. that's the bell, the notification bell, to get notified when new videos are posted out, mm -hmm. it's me. And check out our videos for more of the reading series. Bye bye for now.